Hi folks, this is all the fruit. I'm in the Parca Moise Turm or Park at the Mouse Tower in the beautiful little town of Bingen in Germany. And this park, yeah, this park features a nice orchard and also a very nice vineyard. As you can see here on the opposite side, we had a wine growing area. But well, the vineyard is meticulously labeled. The orchard isn't, which is a pity. I would have liked to make a video about the orchard, but just showing you apples and pears and plums without knowing the varieties would be a little bit boring. Well, but I'm gonna show you the current section. Well, the current, current section, I guess I'm pronouncing it wrong. It's a bit neglected, as you can see. A lot of them are dead. The rest, lots of weeds growing everywhere. Even a cherry tree already almost four meters tall. Well, I don't know what the dead current here is. Could be black current from the leaves. Here is some red current, almost unripened, being overgrown by brambles and other stuff. But this current here is interesting. Not exactly sure what it is. It looks like a bit like Ribes aureum, the golden current. But I'm not sure, so I want you to help me. Well, let's look at this current. The plants get pretty tall, about two meters or six to seven feet. The leaves look a lot like Ribes aureum, but still not sure. The fruit are not completely ripe, so they look pretty colorful now. They grow in those grapes or clusters here with some, uh, what would you call those, bracts? Well, there are some leaves in those clusters. I'm not sure what to call them in that uh, in, in that occasion, leaves in the inflorescence. The fruits seem to be black when they get ripe. I don't think they are completely ripe, but since I'm not coming to big and regularly, I'm gonna try those. At least they are ripe fish. Very nice and shiny fruit. Yeah, look at those nice colors. Like the green gets a little brownish hue and then gets kind of orangish and then the red and then kind of purple. And then black. Yeah, very beautiful stuff. If it's Ribes aureum, Ribes aureum is not used as a fruit shrub here in Germany. It's used as an ornamental. Beautiful beautiful uh, flowers and beautiful fruit and yeah this could be Ribes aureum but it could also be some hybrid I'm, I forgot what Ribes aureum looks like exactly and this reminds me of it especially the leaves but not completely sure well long story short let's try it hmm hmm Definitely under, right? Yep. Yeah. Ripe fish, but not truly ripe. I mean, the berries are a bit hard, so, yeah. Hmm. Tart. A little bit tart. So I guess when it's completely ripe, it will probably not be tart at all. Hmm. Well, I mean, phew. If I would taste the underripe red currant here. Yeah, the red currant is a bit more sweet and aromatic, but also tart. Hmm. So yeah, interesting. Sorry that I couldn't present you with completely ripe berries. Well, here is one which is already softish. Let's look up. Come back. Let's pop it. That's what it looks on the inside. Kind of 
greenish come on focus yeah ripe fish but not ripe I don't know folks I don't want to I don't want to judge this fruit too harshly it's not completely ripe but for now I would say it's inferior to the currants grown here as as uh, fruit shrubs so please tell me folks is this Rimasaurium is this maybe some hybrid with Rimasaurium is it something completely different maybe I will research it too and write some name uh, on the video so yeah stay tuned for a lot more fruit videos from the beautiful country of Germany and don't forget to like share comment and subscribe